Fresh is uh uh DJ Fresh is you know Bay Area Bay Area raised Baltimore bred mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying uh you know artist music musician um uh, just a music connoisseur um you know what I'm saying uh, produced a lot of shit a lot of stuff for the uh, West Coast the Bay Area but I started out I started DJing when I was nine years old. Mm. Um, my pedigree is, you know, my pops was a DJ. Uh, two brothers, they both DJs. Mm -hmm. Music was real big in my family. I was just born with hella records, you know what I'm saying? Like, like all my family kept their records, so right. naturally I got them all, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. And uh, I inherited them all. And, um, you know, I'm just a DJ Fresh. is just a, uh, I would like to say, like, like the like the Jake Dilla or something of the Bay or something, you know, or the West Coast or the Bay. I would say the Bay, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, you know, I'm the people's DJ, I'm the people's champ. You know what I'm saying? Like yes, I'm the dude who uh you might not have a name but you you raw right. and I'll do something with you or you the most popular in the city right. and you gotta tap in with me. Exactly. You feel me? <laughs> so yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm just uh, um, you know. That's 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 a glimpse. Right. Of DJ Fresh. I can't even squeeze it all into <laughs> okay. one question, but, uh, but yeah, though, yeah, you know. Mm. I'll describe my sounds like uh, um, my sound is like it's like uh, it's like comfort food. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. like like it's it's comfortable when you hear it. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's put you uh, it, it puts you in a certain zone. Puts you like. You know, you could play it anywhere. Like, mm -hmm. um, it's just, it's just home. It just feel like home, I guess. Right. You know what I'm saying? I would describe it as that. Just like, you know, it feel good when it come on. It's uh, melodic, mm -hmm. more, more music influence, like more very musical, but you know, still got that slap on it though too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was making these beats and shit, and. I just was like, at the time, everybody was doing mixtapes, mm -hmm. like, like uh, getting like the hottest like instrumental, mm -hmm. and then getting with like the hottest like local artists, right. and then you know, just putting it together. putting it out, and I was like, yeah, that's cool, but you probably ain't gonna remember that shit like mm -hmm. ten years from now exactly. or five years from now, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? So I was like, I'll do the same thing, but I'd rather just produce the whole album mm -hmm. with my beats, right. you know what I'm saying? And people gonna remember it. It's like how you say that was your favorite one. Exactly. That was that was ten years ago. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So that's how that concept came about. And I make so many back then, like, man, I was making probably like twenty, thirty beats like every day. Mm. You feel know I me? Mean? Like I still got beats. <laughs> <That day? laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> Off no no drugs, no stun, it's just Hennessy and shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but uh yeah, like that's what time it was like. I was grinding. I was grinding them out, and not even not even on some like trying to have high quantity. I just was like, I was just motivated. You know right. what I'm saying? I'm still motivated like that. I don't bust down thirty no more. Right. But that's just where it come from. So I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna build my brand, and it just it just worked out. It's like you know, like the Tonight Show has become like um like the Gangsta Grills of the mm -hmm. uh, West Coast mm -hmm. or something. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I've done forty Tonight Shows. Wow. Yeah. But I've done. 60 DJ Fresh projects mm -hmm. in 10 years. Yeah. The Messy Marv and the Yuck Mop one was a turning point mm -hmm. when I did those two. Uh, at the time, you know, Mess was the hottest thing moving. You know right. what I'm saying? And we did a Tonight Show and it was like, it was, it was like, it was huge. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, Mess was like, people yeah. still want to hear what Mess got to say. Like, yeah, even, right. even, you know, whatever you're going through, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Bless his heart. But uh, that was a turning point. And then the Yuck Mob one, the Yuck Mob one was big too because Yuck was the first artist to to really be like, no, nah, this is my album. Right. You know what I'm saying? Not to discredit any of the other ones, but Yuck was like, no, nah, this is my album. Like, he went to Denmark, did videos over there. He went to, you know what I'm saying? I think he right. went to Australia and did a really few videos. Good. Like, he was like, like really going hard with it. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And so it was like a turning point. And, um, uh, what else was a big one? For the Freddie Gibbs one. That was a, that was a huge one too. Right. Cause you see where Freddie at now. Like exactly. Freddie is killing. So that was mm -hmm. a, that was a blessing for me. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Uh, 
But yeah, all of them was dope, man. All of them, all of them like play. They they all play their part. You know what I'm right. saying? Like it's a two way street. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't do it without them and vice versa. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like we help each other. That one was. That's uh, crazy. Yeah, that mm. was like that was like. Yeah, that was crazy too. You know what I'm saying? They all a blessing. Right. They all a blessing. Yes, sir. Uh, me and Lil B doing something. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we're going to call it Tonight Show yet, mm -hmm. but um, at this point, it's like everything is a Tonight Show. Like, people, like, even when I don't, they don't call it a Tonight Show, people are like, oh, I heard that Tonight, tonight Show. show. Yeah. Ooh, so it's like, you know, yeah, however you want to tire it, but we doing a, a body of work. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Uh, me and Stalin, we doing a Tonight Show. Mm -hmm. um, me and Arada. Mm. Roger J. Clyde. Yeah, man. Uh, I got, I got, I got a few. Yeah, I got, I got a few. I don't like to say everything I'm doing and shit, but right. I got, I got, I got a few. I got a few.